Welcome, welcome everyone. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. I'm having a pretty good one. So I was sitting here getting some things done and uh, got a bit of an annoying things kind of stomping around it. Thankfully that pair of Ethereum has finally walked away. Think about taming it because it's level 100, but I don't know. That's, ooh, I want that red gem. Uh, what level are you? Level 10? Yeah, we'll take that red gem. Thank you. But, uh, think about taming it because it's a level 100, but at the same time, it's awful expensive to tame it. And I don't know. We'll see. It doesn't seem to be going anywhere. Ooh, there's another red gem. Oh. Thank you. Oh, I missed the red gem. Dag nabbit. I didn't see the second one. I could have used that really bad, too. I need them red gems. They're incredibly hard to get. And, uh,. I actually asked around, and apparently the only place to get them is from purple crystals that somewhere is called the Spine. And I still have not explored very far because it's dangerous out there. And, yeah, I have no idea where the Spine is at. I'm told it's irradiated. I don't know how I'm supposed to go there. Like, yeah, one of them things. But, uh, yeah, uh, today, got a few things going. I was wanting to go tame a mole rat, but, uh, I don't know if that's going to happen because, uh, hmm, okay, he did move. Um, one, because the, their saddles are extremely expensive. I don't know if we can do that or not yet. Uh, I also did, in fact, paint myself a, uh, no dickers. Uh, I didn't figure, you know, it was all that big of a deal to get it on film because, it's, you know, it's just a no dickers. He does glow really cool, though, when the dark, which is really cool. But, uh, yeah. He was just a low level, I think 40, 50 or 60, something like that, I don't even remember. You don't need those on you. But, uh, so I, I wasn't that worried about him, but, uh, I do want to do a little bit of base building today. And as you can see, I've, I've built a little bit, and I'm not completely happy with what I got set up. What I think I'm actually going to do is a little bit something different than what Give me that, yeah, and that. Uh, we'll do something a little bit different than what I normally do. Instead of just building one um, thing like this and, you know, building around it, I think I'm actually going to build a gate here and then a gate here and uh, have the center be my work area. That way I can go here on both sides, you know. And uh, <laughs> so far, wood is turning out to be the big, the big, big one. That's why I want a mole rat because... From what I understand, the uh, mole rats are wood harvesters. Sometimes these sounds and these quakes like really worry me. But uh, <laughs> these like cave shakes and earthquakes drive me crazy. I want all the stuff. But um, get distracted, get distracted. Uh, yeah. So I'm having a bit of an issue. I, I've, goodness gracious, I've got a ton of wood right now. I'm gonna have to go get more stone. Matter of fact, which is kind of funny. Uh, huh. But uh, there's a few things I've discovered that I do want, in fact, to share. And we're going... Actually, you know what? We'll keep this on us because... Let's grab a stack of this. I, oh, no, I guess we won't. <laughs> that's overweight. Oh, that's right, because I got all those on. Let's put those down real quick. Real quick, like... Uh, did I get the full 100 stack? Okay. I made a discovery, and uh, this was by pure chance, and it's kind of funny because uh, I found this out last night before I st uh, stopped playing and then just so happened it was mentioned in conversation right after that but check this out all right this guy well I really like them they seem a little bit weak I don't know he don't do he does not do a lot of damage which is really weird because the wild ones are just evil they do that gash and th that is just it, it honestly I think it needs to be changed the gash attack is too much matter of fact right now down there well, I'm not going to run all the way, but down there next to the lake is a pack of like 10 of the things. And it, it, there's nothing you can do. I mean, there's literally nothing you can do. It is just just bad all around. But check this out, y'all. All right, you see this right here? Obsidian, 8 pounds. Transfer it over. Okay, let's pull it back real quick. Okay, 10 pounds, 1 pound a piece. You put it on him, it weighs 5 pounds. It reduces it by half. You see the metal? Uh, instead of weighing 100... It weighs 50. It's everything that you harvest, like this, as you can see, 
11, 5. It's all halved. All of it. And uh, for basically what I can figure out is it's pretty much anything quote unquote stone or wood, which is thatch, um, the crystals, metal, uh, wood, stone itself. Um, I'm not sure if this is or not. Let's check. No, not. That is the only one that's not. But everything else, everything. Hold on, here we go. This is perfect. All of this right here is reduced by half when he carries it. Now, there may be a few other items that I just haven't come across. You know, like I think this probably is as well. Yeah, so basically anything like this is reduced by half. And that is fantastic. Like, that's, that, that, that's great because that means you can use him as transport for uh, weight and you can go out and farm you know because unlike previous versions of art the farming is a bit different on this one and uh matter of fact i don't even know if there are ankies here i'm sure there might be somewhere but um i'm gonna put that pick back on him because he is my farm two guy right now and we've been going out and making metal runs with him and it's fantastic. Let's take that. Can I carry that? Yo, oh, just barely. Uh, but I've been making metal runs. And uh, something really crazy is uh, I think the metal produces much more when you harvest it on here. Matter of fact, this is all one metal run. And I only harvested two rich metal stones. And I left others because I, I have sometimes I have a bit of an issue where the resources don't want to respawn. And I really just didn't want to push it and, you know, not be able to get it back. But, uh, that's pretty crazy because, I mean, that, that's, that's a lot of metal. Like, that's a lot of metal. But, uh, before we go off and do anything real quick, I do want to start a little bit more on the building of what I'm doing. And, um, uh, I think what I'm going to do is, let's see. No, we want, did I, I put that back, didn't I? Duh. always getting ahead of myself and behind myself and sideways and upside down and all that craziness but uh, I want to put these foundations real, down real quick before we go now all of this stuff here in the middle is this is S plus that I'm putting down but everything in the middle is not and uh, I am going to pick the, the middle walls up and probably convert them to S plus but I'm not going to bother with the foundations because there's just no reason. And the only reason I'm going to do the walls is just to keep from wasting resources. Because this stuff's expensive. Uh, <laughs> it is a little silly just how much it costs to do everything. But, um, so yeah, I'm trying to figure exactly what I want to do first. I want to put these in the back first. I think I do. So let's, okay, well, let that go there. There we go. No. Okay, what is going on here? Pick this up. We we'll go there now. Yeah, there we go. All right, one more. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. No, what happened? Where'd it go? I don't know where it went. Clearly, it didn't go where I wanted it. Okay, there we go. Now let's put this back. Nope, wrong one. Ta da! Uh. Uh. What do you have in bunches of oh that's one I did not check. We'll have to check that real quick. We'll see if um uh charcoal is reduced weight on the Ravager or yeah, Ravager or not. We'll see. Switch the stairs because you know why not? Let's have some stairs here. Let's see, where is he at? And uh I've been thinking about it and you know there is an awful lot of stuff on here that uses metal and gas and from what I understand the only way to get gas no it does not reduce the weight okay the only way to get gas is basically you you, you take oil and hide well the only oil comes from trollopites dung beetles and uh, I think something else might drop it uh, I'm not honestly 100% sure on that um, so basically, you're kind of, unless you go to the surface, which, for what I understand, is, is just deadly. 
uh, at least until almost end game, there's no way to get oil except for finding a dung beetle. And that's just crazy because what? And that's like the red crystals. I mean, some of the stuff, it just doesn't make sense to me because you need the red crystals to make the uh, gas pump. But the gas pump is fairly early on, so if the red crystals exist in an irradiated zone, how do you, like, I don't, I don't understand. Like, I it just, I'm confused. I don't get how it's supposed to work. You know, it don't, it don't add up to me. And I don't know. I'll figure it out eventually, I guess. But, uh, goodness gracious. This stuff is stacked. There you go. Put another stack of wood in there because that's a lot of metal to burn. I don't know. It just seems odd to me. I'm not. I'm kind of questioning some of the design choices, but uh, still having lots of fun. I, uh, no, tech damn it! I need to get rid of that. We're going to do some serious rearranging at some point, y'all. Like it's going to be an absolute change all the way around. I'm going to have to move some stuff. This is going to expand. We're going to have room for everything. Got to get rid of all my stuff. But uh, what I wanted to do today is one. I want to play with the um. What are they called? The, uh, the zip line and the, um, let's get this and pick that up, pick that up, that, and that, but I want to play with the zip line and, uh, experiment with it for a little bit, which we have to craft them. Nope, nope, get rid of the gun. I guess it get rid of the gun. Get rid of the gun. There we go. Oh, a little more difficult than it needed to be. Uh, <laughs> but I want to experiment with it and um, see how it works. I've heard some rumors that I'd like to test out. We're going to need to make a bunch more walls. I can see that already. Matter of fact, I need to pick two of those up because they don't go there. These right here dehydrated that is fine we're gonna go get some water and just a, no wait what did I not I am just completely out of it today apologize apologies apologies I am not fully here today so I'm going to probably be making a bunch of mistakes like I just did I just goofed it all up all over the place okay okay what is this that's right uh, that's plus right there Ah, <sighs> there we go. Alright, we're sealed in. We're sealed in. Good, we are sealed in. <sighs> swear. <laughs> Alright, let's go back around here. I ain't really worried about some of these being as close as some of them not. That don't matter. That is not important. And... Look at that. We've already just made a whole bunch more space. It's fantastic. I love it. Yeah, yeah, we may have to switch that because I prefer these walls, the way they look over these walls, but eh, whatever. So let's see. Um Uh Okay, yeah, let's let's grab some berries real quick. Get a little bit of water. Um Uh let's just yeah, let's just use these. These things don't give as much water as they I thought they did, but whatever. And I've also uh yeah, I have found a weird zone over that way that like I'll show you real quick I'm not going to go over because it it's really far away and there's a bunch of ravagers over there but I want to point this out because I don't want to forget about it right over there there's a ramp that goes up and it travels around this way and for some reason every time I go up there it's instant like instant death like I start to have the mushroom hallucination effect Everything goes absolutely haywire, and then that's all she wrote. Let's see, how far out is that water? Can I jump from up here? I didn't even make my zip line either, did I? No, I didn't. Oh, well. Uh, <laughs> oh, well, let's see. Y'all ready for this? This could be bad. This could be real bad. Woohoo! And splash! Oh yeah. And also y'all check this out. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. 
I have found something. It's fantastic. Are you ready for this? I had no. Okay, I guess I can't climb there. Swim, doggy, swim. Check this out. Boom. There's a cave here. Like, an actual, honest to goodness, cave. Which just cracks me up a little bit because, you know, it's a cave inside of a cave. <laughs> and this is the old railway cave. And I have not explored it. I don't really plan to go too deep into it yet because, uh, you know, caves. Uh, I don't. While in the real world, I am all about caves. I'm not a big fan of caves in Ark. They are... They tend to be dangerous and unfriendly places that are not really suitable for single players. Even though I am playing online, they just ain't the same. Oh, 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 what the... Oil, give me your oil, oil, give me your oil. Arr. Yeah, oil. But anyways, reason why we jumped down here was that end. I want to show you all, there is, there is metal down here. And metal is increasingly difficult to find in this uh, art. The, the aberration is just an absolute mess when it comes to metal. But right here, and you got to be careful because there's red mushrooms over there that are just evil. But we got crystal and we got metal. Now watch this, y'all. Look how much metal I pull up off this thing. I don't know. And like my, my harvest rates are not high, so it's a little crazy. Look at this. Look, look. This is just a regular pick. It's not a not an enhanced pick. It's, it's just a straight primitive pick. And look at this. It is absolute ridiculous. I am almost a 400 metal off of one stone. Look at that. We're climbing. We're still going. So 463 metal off of that one. Like, you. Will you come closer to me? You know. Whatever. That's fine. I don't care. We can throw it in front of you. Just as long as I don't lose it. <laughs> okay. There we go. And now what's even better is I can just throw this all on this dude and he ain't got no problem carrying it whatsoever. It's fantastic. I love it. I love it so much. But, as I was saying, red mushrooms. And they suck. And I figured these things out. Yeah, I have, I had one. I I I kind of died and I lost it. But this is apparently a species Z. And if you just stand here long enough, I was actually I wasn't even paying attention. I was just standing there, and it spit out a seed. And it takes forever. Like it it, it took forever. Like I said, I wasn't even paying attention. I was doing something else. And I was standing next to the one up next to the base, just hanging out. And it spit out a seed, and I was like, what? And then I I. I kind of got killed by something and I never got back to base with it so I don't know what they do we're definitely gonna have to deal pull, play around with it and check them out and see what exactly they do but yeah that is just awesome but uh, anyways let's, let's make sure I'm close enough to this dude that I can don't have to worry about it I'm gonna farm up a little bit more of this metal I'm going to get back to base and uh, we'll pick up there and uh, we'll play with the uh, zip line so I'll see you in just a minute and we're back all right y'all <laughs> having some fun playing around on the mushrooms i love these grappling hooks y'all like this is fantastic or these climbing hooks whatever they're called anyways we're up here above my base and we're over here next to the charge node which i want to see something real quick i have a theory you stay there i, I know you can take the uh, go up to the glow bugs and pull charge off of them but I don't know. Can you do it off of these? Maybe. Maybe not. I don't think so. Are you pulling charge from that? No, you're not. Okay. So that's weird. I thought maybe he'd pull a charge from that because it's got a 5,000 charge on it. And I thought I'd check. It does not have an appearance. But if you go up to the glow bugs, you can pull a charge off of them if you got one of these guys on your shoulder. And uh, I'm assuming there's a thing called a battery you can do it with as well. I don't know. But anyways, we want to test out the grappling hook or the zip line. And uh, I've put, whoo, no, get rid of that. I've put a um, uh, pillar down there to sh aim for, which, I mean, I don't know how this thing is going to shoot. I don't know. Like, I, 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 honestly, I have no idea how this is going to work, y'all. Like, I really don't have a clue. 
And, uh, I, oh, I think my dude just turned off. I was like, what was that? I think, I, I'm pretty sure I can stick it to a tree, but I don't want to stick it to a tree. I'd rather stick it to stone and then be able to, you know, zip line without worrying about it going away. But the thing is, is I should have knocked that tree down. <laughs> But uh, the question is, is does this thing shoot in a straight line, or does it dip down, or what? So let's find out. I have no idea how these work. Uh, no, I mean, like, I know absolutely nothing, so that's... Alright, so they do fall. Okay, that's fine. So now I need to find a point, I guess, point B. Hmm. I wonder if I undo that, if I'll get that zip line back. Don't bet I don't. Alright, it looks like I can do it. Right here. Alright, so, now I heard a rumor that these dudes can, can... Did that work or did that not work at all? Okay, I heard this rumor that these dudes can walk on zip lines. I don't know if that's true or not. I don't know how I would test that without... Oh, and we're going to fall. Well, pfft. All right, we'll find out down here. Uh, where is it at? Can y'all see it? I can't see it. Wow, oh, that thing is... That's near invisible. So, okay, let's go down here and find out if he can or not. But I hear this rumor that these dudes can walk on zip lines. And I don't know. That, that seems... Yeah, see, that don't seem... Like that's something that's gonna work. Like, I may have to look into that. But like I said, I, it's just something I heard... I don't know if it's true, and uh, it appears to not be true. So we're going to ride zipline. Okay, <laughs> that's funny. All right, does this got any more options? Okay, no. All right, we're going to run back up here real quick, and we're going to check this thing out. Actually, you know what? We'll take him because he's faster, and I can just set him down follow, and he'll just jump right off. Ew, dude, don't poop in front of everybody. That's rude. All right, let's go. Quick run. It's dark. I can't see nothing. I can't figure out the day, day and night cycle in this game, y'all. Like, this. Like, get out of the way, rocks. Like, at 10 o'clock in the morning, it's dark. And then it gets bright. And then it gets dark. And then it gets bright. And, like, I, I don't know what's going on. Like, what? <laughs> Thought I heard something. Okay. But yeah, I keep. I've heard this rumor twice now from two different people. Unrelated to each other, these guys, the Ravager, can walk on zip lines. I don't know how we'd make him do it if he can. Like, that seems a little out there if you ask me. Hmm. But I am getting old. Y'all see that? Oh, look. Look, he can. That is awesome. Oh, that is the coolest. Uh oh. Can he go up the zip line? <gasps> oh, okay, 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 okay. So this is how you do this. Okay. All right, I, I figured this out. All right, so jump, hops off. Okay, so the trick is, all right, so I, I got this now. I understand what we got going on, y'all. All right, so for me, I walk up and just click E and off we go. And bam. I really wish I would have stuck to that thing. We're probably going to have to do that. Probably have to do that again. Where's he at? Did he? Did he follow me on the zip line? What? Give me this wood. Check it out. He followed me on the zip line, you all. I think he followed me. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Alright, so now the trick with him is to get the line. Y'all seen how that little icon appeared, right? Let's see, look, I'll show you one more time. That's how you do it. You get that little crosshair and jump. And off we go. Okay, so that one's in the way too. I was trying to leave these trees and stone around my base. That way I'd have it in case I need it and I'm burnt, so you know. But anyways, that is absolutely awesome. Like, I, I just, I don't even got words. That is the coolest thing ever. Now, let's find out. Does he, in fact... This is really difficult to my dude to, like... Look, look, check him out. <laughs> He's walking the zip line. That is awesome. 
Oh, that is so cool. That is so cool. That is one of the coolest things ever added to Ark. Flat out. And there is... Check this out. I found this. Didn't know this was even a thing. Uh, no. Zip. Okay, yeah. There is a zipline motor attachment that says equip this to the pants, onto pants, and combine with gasoline to power yourself up a zipline. Now, I don't think I have 40 gems, and I definitely don't have 15, and I haven't made a fabricator yet. And all this stuff is super expensive. Like, it's, it's silly. Like, I mean, look at this. Hold on. The rat. Look how much the rat saddle costs. 425 metal. Like, what in the world? That is ridiculous. Ridiculous! A lot of this stuff costs things like that. Like this thing, this thing, I'm from what I understand is extremely like it's required, but it costs twenty red gems, and I don't think you can even get red gems other than the rat, the the roll rat, occasionally, and then the spine at the purple crystals. So like, what in the world? And then there's also this thing, which I'm gonna have to try out. That is a portable smithy, basically. It lets you repair smithy items for double the cost, which is crazy. But, uh, that's stuff for later on. Like, I'm not worried about that stuff right now. What I really wanted to do was I really wanted to play with this. No, wrong button. And that is just, I mean, check us out, y'all. We are tightrope walking. We are awesome. Like, that is... The coolest thing ever. Like it, it's just that's just that's just awesome. That it, that's just awesome. Like and to turn around, all we do is just turn around. No, okay, yeah. No, you hit down. Okay, you hit down to turn around. That's how you turn around. And yeehaw! Look at the way it's it, it's so cool. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. All right, well. I hate to say it, we have kind of come up on our time. That's a lot of fun. Like, I, <laughs> I'm going to have zip lines everywhere, y'all. Like, that is totally worth the cost. But, uh, we have come up on that time, so I hate to say it. We're going to have to go. And, uh, we'll come back next time and play around with some more stuff. And I hopefully, hopefully, hopefully next time we're going to go get us a uh, roll rat. Like, that's the big plan. But, uh, we don't know. We'll see. So, if y'all enjoyed this episode at all, smack that thumbs up button. I appreciate it if you do. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Share this if you would so others can find it easier. It helps them out. helps me out. And it's an amazing thing to do. Remember y'all, stay safe, have fun, and art is life.